Hey everyone, I'm Joel from JD Beauty, and I'm joined here by the amazing Vasi, and we're here live at the Ice Show ISSE, and we're gonna show you some some techniques that you can do to get maximum volume on the head. Vasi's gonna give you a quick demonstration. Vasi, what are your favorite techniques and tools to use when uh, you're trying to build volume in the hair? You know, right now I'm, I'm using our wet brush teasing comb. The one thing I like to do, this whole show we've been talking about creating a shape within a tease. So it's more of an organized tease. It's not just random. So I'm gonna share with you guys right now how to get that beautiful shape in the, in the hair. So what I do is I like to grab a section. We're gonna go ahead and over direct it, just like this. And we're gonna focus on that root first to really create a nice base. From there, I'm gonna start working down towards the mid and kind of bringing it over to create more of a shape within the tease. And then up top here, I'm just gonna smooth it down just like that. So what this is going to do is give me a little bit more of that fluffier texture. So the walking it down will give you more of a of a shape to it versus going straight up there. Exactly. This way it's not just focusing just on that root, but we're actually building shape down in the base as well too here. So, so you've got a teasing brush. Is there any tip that you could use or give to us when you're... Uh, uh, difference between a teasing brush versus a comb. Anything you can add on that? Yeah, like, you know, sometimes I like to use a detangler as well, the detangling comb, just to go through, because it gives me volume in the hair, but it also gives me definition as well, too. <laughs> Here we go. Show us with that, how you're going to do that. Like, if I wanted to as well, I would just go on in like this, push up, shake it, pull out. So I'm, like, this is a, a more of a wave look that we're doing. So I'm going within the ridges and pushing up. So what this is doing is giving me that volume. Daily. Without disrupting the shape. Exactly. Yep. Absolutely. Now, uh, you know, I have a shine enhancer here, and for me, when you're trying to build volume that's going to go uh, out and wide, or you want something that feels like pillow padding, you know, you want to make it like juicier, thicker. I like to take our shine brush and use that as a uh, as an expansion tool. Now, I'm not going to do it right now because he's already set his look, but I use it as an expansion tool to really kind of like gather a lot of hair it gets it real pillowy there's not the architecture that you would normally get from a comb per se now i'm using one of our newly designed wet brush pro brushes this is so amazing this can only be got at the salon so your customers can't find this anywhere but from you we have a new handle more comfortable to use it's rubber non-slip grip and these little finger spots here on the brush Put your fingers there, go to town. All the new designs for 2000, all the new designs that we have at Wet Brush have this pro design with you in mind. So come check us out, and we hope to see you guys using our tools soon.